Haha, today is the Neon Neon MSN 04 Mobile Suit Sasabi. It's quite a big box. Very big. One, two, about two and a, two thirds. Yep, huge box. Bought uh, through or from Oh My God Gundam from Facebook. It was taken in Rawang near Kuala Lumpur. 2016 about three months ago 125 ringgit that's roughly 30 US dollars plus plus 30 times 4 120 ringgit ish ish so let's see here Taban model not from Bandai it's roughly the same shit it's got the nice LMG like machine gun ish looking thing the aliens rifle looking thing Nothing here and nothing there. So I never knew that I was was going to get this because I thought it was very hard to procure such a unit. The points of freshness here and here. And this has already been tampered with. So what's this? So let's open it up. The real stuff is I'm not sure how much it is and maybe about I'm not sure. No idea how much the original stuff uh, costs. Hmm. Oh that's a lot of runners man. Holy shit. This one here with the sticker sheets there, so a lot of work. It's gonna be a lot of work with that uh, Little ball, one packet, mm, two packets, three packets with the gas tank cylinder, the weapon system, the big huge ass shield. Oh, it's kind of like silvery. Hmm. The inner frame. And this one here. So my next packets is almost like a like a oh that's the light thing. It's almost like a like a puffy grade. Again the silver the reds. I can feel that there's one type of red, another type of red and a darker red. Darker red, medium red, bright red. And this black thing here with that tick thing here. It's gonna be quite cool to build it. It's following maybe this one here, this artwork. I like the artwork, the artwork looks nice. I already have a, a sasabi there that's a high grade, the best proportion high grade so far. Oh, maybe. Not so far. This has been usurped by this thing. We we'll go for the old master grade version because uh, lots of people say that the proportions are nigh terrible. It's not not the same as what you see in the anime. Of course, anime was made in the nineteen eighties or nineteen nineties, I think. This one here, World Car version, as you can see or know, it's not going to be like the anime version. It's going to be a totally different beast. In itself, this is an old kit. It's 2014, if I'm not mistaken, or was it 2015? I think it's 2015. So there'll be plenty of reviews out there about this kit. And when did this uh, Daban model came out? Uh, I'm not sure. No idea. So it's going to be quite exciting. Hopefully, you will be excited as I am. My god Himul, I'm so surprised when I saw this. It comes with batteries, oh my god. Is this a special edition? Yeah, special edition. Special editions normally accompany all these like, first first edition uh, Gundam kits from those Chinese uh, factories. So this one here with batteries, oh my god. Now I can actually test the batteries or the lights. 
that uh, is available for the Jetstar and that's about it. There's no other kits that uses this lighting. Maybe this one. Huh, maybe it can light in this perfect grade one. The rest, uh, nope. Not on this fella. Not on that master grade unicorn because I don't want to take that thing's backpack out of its chest or back. I don't think it can. I'm not sure. I don't remember whether it has a chest cavity or not. But it should have. But I doubt it. And uh, who else has those lighting mechanisms? Uh, this one, the doubles, definitely would have a lot of those cavities especially the GN drives and the rest no I don't think it works there uh, does it work on the the Zaku uh, I don't think so because the backpack is already tattered to the front part so nope that's all only the just just uh, and uh, this one there and maybe no no I don't think that works on this no 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 nope just two things. Oh, I can test it now. Nice. I'm very surprised. Batteries. Lovely. Normally it does not come with batteries at all. Okay, let's go and look at the runners and stuff. And the song is Sabotens Panzer Kampf. Uh, I can lower down the music so that it won't be unmonetized because of copyright. Let's start with the runners. Uh, yeah. Okay, the runners A. A is uh, this one, A2 and A1. So there are two runners. It's slightly silver. So not bad. Slightly silver A. This one is slightly bigger, this A. A1 to be exact. It's for the hands you can see this one's for the hands and maybe for the uh, inner inner skirt armor yes the inner skirt has inner frame what wait the armor skirt has inner frame B for oh boy lots and lots of thrusters my god lots and lots of thrusters all yellow unfortunately same as this B B2 C is an is black in color and there's a big gun very big gun indeed it's for the, the side uh, torso lovely this is E wait wait what the oh sorry C runner is the shield it's a big piece of shield. This is the D. E is a shield as well and the fuel tanks. E2 is also the fuel tanks but smaller, the runner. F is the outer armor. F2 is similar but smaller. This is for a shield, I think. This whole piece, who knows? And also the for the legs and whatnot. This is a very weird looking piece. Hmm. This is the G runner, very huge, very very huge. Finito. Next. H okay H wow what the hell is this so many like flaps oh this is for the what you call uh, small little buggers that fly around and it's inside the container attached to the backpack similar here this is another H runner and a dark burgundy color here the I runner so And this is the J. K 
double K actually same old thing the L where it has the translucent uh, transparent bits this is the cockpit that I think is going to be near the head M is this one here the oh ah, it's quite a letdown that it is not going to be real uh, you know there is no spring to actually put cufflinks over which is of course which is a welcome because putting those cufflinks and cutting them from the sprue or the runner is quite a hassle but then again you get used to doing the zaku too so it would be nice since this master grade is very detailed it would be nice to have a detail like so being not as one plastic but as spring and many many cufflinks but this one here is so weird. This one seems like it's supposed to have so those little little cufflinks all over it. This is for I'm not sure what part. Maybe it's for the the cuff the railing or sorry the pipes around the waist. Who knows? Not sure. It's a big piece here for the ass, I mean back armor, the back skirt. So thrusters are all one piece, so it would be nice to actually have its own piece, but uh, what can you do? It's simple. Cool. Double of these fluorescent green lightsaber effect parts. And that's finished. So many runners, my god. What have I done? Next up. The P part. In a frame, and this one here, the thrusters are all in one piece. Weird. As for the thrusters, this one here is what is the P? Another P, so it's double P's. Another double Q's. This is the Q's in a frame. All in a frame. This is the Q as well. This is an R. R is the uh, X and inner frame parts. So is this one the R is another R? Is the R1 and R2? Is the S the machine gun the LMG like machine gun look alike? This is the polystyrene. Uh, what do you call these things? I forgot what the name it is. Uh, I'm not sure what it's called already. And of course the dreaded hands. 3.0 hands is it called? It's scary to actually take it out of the sprue. And next these things. Well, these are the stickers. <laughs> Red stickers. And this is uh... ah water slide decals I think yeah it should be water slide I hope yep I think it's water slides have to put in water and take it out and dump in it will be easier to to what do you call to position the decals when it's a water slide so right so see you in the next video